Hello everyone, this is Oni and welcome back to FTL Mods on the fourth venture of the Bioni collab. I say collab in massive air quotes and I am waving my fingers in air quotes because it's Bio who's doing all the hard work. Our fourth venture is a slug ship. The slug cruiser, um, well we can't change the type A. With, that's the text we can't change. This prototype slug cruiser is equipped with two experimental weapons, the Chaos Cluster Bomb and the Arc Beam to defeat the crew of enemy ships. It's an alternate take on, it's called the, the Nebula Drifter. Um, this time the name is actually, um, I mean Bio came up with the name, all three, well not all three, um, Bio also came up with the Magpie. Okay, so this is, you know, the Nebula Drifter. I couldn't think of any idea because slug ships don't have a theme name like bards or anything like that like minerals for crystals bards for you know lanius federation kestrel yeah so um i think nebula drift is fine uh all right so these are the two weapons as you can see new sprites and bio had to actually paint these well he just appropriated the base some um, image of the bio beam and edited it Hey, hey, bio beam, get it? Okay, fine. <laughs> uh, Alright, so um, this ship starts with a clone bay, starts with the Chaos Cluster Bomb, fires three bombs with a medium chance to light a fire or cause a hull breach or a stun while dealing minor damage to personnel. More power means faster cooldown. It is, does 15 damage to crew. Um, the cooldown rate is actually the same as the default artillery of the game, so it's 50 second, 40 second, 30 and 20. No issues there. Uh, and this is the arc beam, modified from the anti-bio beam. The arc beam does less damage to crew but can deal damage to systems. It takes 2 power, charge time is 15 seconds, 1 second less than the bio beam. It has no hull damage, it has 1 system damage and does half crew damage of the bio beam. So it takes twice as many shots to kill. But it arc beams, as in, you know, lore wise, I got a pretty neat lore, lore text, wall of text sent to bio, hopefully he'll put it up on the forum. It's not outed, it just, we just made the definitive version right now, we just decided on it. And one more thing, this game, this ship actually utilizes a strategy unused in the game. <laughs> Interesting, yes, yes. But look at this. Like, look at it, it's so pretty. Uh, Bio made the hull, Bio made the bomb animation for the weapon, uh, for the bomb artillery weapon. Oh, obviously, it doesn't use any ammo. Uh, and the artillery, um, you know, the bomb sprite itself is different. As you can see, it's a combination of the fire and breach. Um, this one, the purple effect, there's a purple glow. Bio made all of that. And look at this hull image. This is, isn't this just pretty as hell? Like, look at it. Wow, I just. And one more thing. Zero offset. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at it. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, man. Bio learned so much from this. And even uh, replaced, there are two events for the bio beam with uh, blue options Giant Hill Inspiders and another one. Bio actually made corresponding blue options for the arc beam, and they do work. I have seen it. So <laughs> even if you don't, even if I don't see it in this run, it, they work. All right. So let's enough talking for four minutes. Let's just start. Radio in the nebula, as the name goes. All right. So uh, first order of business. How does this ship actually deal damage? Because the arc beam doesn't pierce shields. That's where the combat drone comes in. You use the drone to penetrate the shield of the enemy then deliver the arc it's the exact opposite strategy of ngc the tetragon in that you use the dual laser and then have the beam drone follow up here it's the opposite and that does mean if you come across an anti-drone ship you have to either escape or wait for the chaos cluster bomb to deliver damage uh, it's it's very nice it is very cool all right and that tooltip also works as far as the, uh, right. So uh, let's go. You do start off with one less power for powering everything including the drone. But that's enough. It's 30. Yeah, shut up. Alright, so it's the Nebula Drifter. So we want to go through all the Nebula Beacons. Hopefully I'll get these. Oh. Alright, so let's see if I can get those two and then move in this Nebula. Yeah, that's probably the best option. Alright, moving on. Radio then. 
Okay, a ship that I have to use the combat drone because I can't do all damage anyway. <laughs> Alright. Go combat drone! Don't don't get shot down by the weapon. Dark beam does do system damage, like I said, and that does make it very useful. Unfortunately, I will take Yep, thought so. Ah, the first arc shot you can't see because, well, it has to hit there. It has to. Oh, 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 oh. Right. So, first arc shot of, I mean, first arc shot you missed. Oh, well. Now, we could get that. 20 power, but I think the level 2 shielding is more important. Oh, that's a store. Well, that makes our choice easier. I'm not gonna get rid of slug gel yet, although that could be good, but I'm not gonna. Alright, uh, no, no. Now, um, two humans. Alright, potential arc victims. Oh, that's a lot of shots. I am terrified. Actually, terrified. Alright, one shot is fine. And this is what the arc can do. I'm actually gonna fire that way because I want to take down one of the weapons. Yep. Now it can't damage me, so I can actually turn the Oh no, oxygen can't stay off for a while. Oh, I I, I don't need combat drones, right. You don't actually need combat drones because I want to kill them. I don't actually want to deal damage to them. Which is fine, because the arc will take care of any, uh, sh Alright, we're ready. Alright, uh, combat drone stop. Look at that hot pink. <laughs> uh, oh, man. Such a great idea for a weapon. Alright. Oh, come on, bro. Oh, good thing I'm not delivering actual damage. Brilliant, I think that's, uh... Well, now you get to see the Chaos Cluster Bomb. There's fire, there's fire, there's fire. Okay, there, there's actually... The bomb actually works kind of differently. It first... It, the chance of fire breach and stun isn't exactly equal because the game treats fire as a higher chance, so... Checks for fire first, if that fails, then checks for a breach chance. So yeah, but fire means they're pretty much boned. <laughs> oh, those guys are pretty much boned, so we'll just use the combat drone. Alright. And it's as long as the bio beam. And we win and we get us. Alright. Alright, Mort, stay there. Fun, another funny thing, the entire first part of the ship, there's no <laughs> actual manable or crewable, you know, systems, uh, sensors end up here. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's funny. Um, anyway, nebula drift, time to drift some nebula. Uh, it's actually 12, 16, I'm, it depends on what drops we get. Uh, ooh. ooh, that's bad, that is bad. Although that will fire first, so that's not as bad as I originally thought. So I do need to take care of these two. I need to sneeze also. Hold on. <coughs> oh, man, it's so hot here. I'm catching a heat sweat or whatever you call those things. That does fire first, right? It does. All right. Awesome. Completely missed that out. Okay, move out of the thing path. Awesome. Yes, get those draw chances. Get those draw chances. Obviously, one of the weirder strategies. 
but hey, this is just how we roll. And that being a mantis means the shield is down permanently. Means I can arc away to my leisure. But the arc takes uh, 15 seconds to charge, so... Tell me that name isn't awesome, the arc beam. It, 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 it's, it's pretty cool, man. I like it. Right. Go away. Takes four shots for every um uh, uh it takes four shots for usual crew, three shots for Zoltans, four shots for normal, five shots for um crystals and rocks. Yep. Alright. There's normal, there's a miss, and that's a kill. Brilliant. Right, yeah, yeah, you go there, buddy. And that's the Mantis dead. <laughs> Alright. We we pretty much win. We're gonna take four more shots on this um, guy, but uh, we're gonna try firing at certain places. Namely these places. Oop. Because why not? Yeah, good luck repairing that. You can actually uh, outpower, out repair how much the arc damage because the 15 second charge time. But there's that for ya. Okay, we're getting fire. There is a breach chance. It does happen. Just you're not seeing it. It's weird. Whatever. Oh, also, uh, he has to did the do the three bomb sounds. It originally did only one bomb sound. See, so he actually had to, um, I also had to code that in. Hello, AP drone! See, with the crew kill, you actually get a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff to sell and do things with. Alright, another nebula. Oh. Uh, okay, boarding party, sure. I mean, it's a clone bay ship. What did you expect? Ah. Uh, Let's move this guy here. That'll take care of that. You move in here. It's kind of weird because going from here to this side, you'll have to walk through the entire path. Yes, those are multiple... Um, He just entered. I'm just gonna put him in this room shortly, like right now. See, that was a very good call. Right. Alright. That, that, that went well. Um, let's get one power bar. Sorry, my mouse is acting up a little bit. Can't be helped. Uh, how do I... I eventually have to go through there. Ah, we have a... Quite a bit jumps. Uh, yeah, we'll go through there. Maybe we'll come across a store because I have a DAP drone to sell. Don't need AP drones. Alright, we need one more. Ah, there's a store. Brilliant. Alright. Let's get that. Uh, Alright. Ah, cool. They can't damage me. So I could wait for the bomb. I think I'm gonna wait for the bomb because... Ah, combat drone. Yeah, drones are a necessity. Um, also that, although that, um, mid bay makes me worry. I'll wait for one bomb fire, if that doesn't work, I guess we'll put up the AP drone. Ah, uh, sorry, the combat drone. Long fights at the start, especially after you 
managed to not take damage because you want to save the drone part. Also, um, like the NGA, you can't penetrate level 2 shields, so you need to get some weapons fast. Just the combat drone won't cut it. I mean, you could get lucky, but... Oh yeah, oh yes, oh yes, please. Oh yes, please. Um, I'm gonna use the combat drone, because this is just too good an opportunity to not use it. Yes! Yes! Oh, dude! Dude, you guys are kind of boned! Kind of boned! Just saying. The moment he starts repairing is when I do crazy things. Let's do the arc! Let's do the arc. Alright! That's two down! Done and done! Yeah, I think that one drone part was worth it. Because uh, level 2 medbay is no joke. No joke at all. Alright, so I think going to the store this early or I could probably save it. Let's see there's a distress or something I could probably use that oh um probably should have moved into the there then all right do want the combat drone immediately although I don't need that extra dodge chance I need you out of that room because I need you to go repair when the missile eventually lands probably in this room uh, I can arc once uh, will I arc once that Okay, we got a breach chance, doesn't matter, we got a slug gel. Alright, no, we're not gonna arc it, because um, that might repair fast. Uh, where? Not bad. Do it. Alright, so I want to take down the any of the missiles. Alright, I don't mind a few damage. Saw that coming. Alright. Don't mind a few damage. Where? Same? No. Okay. You don't actually give the same. Alright. Oh yeah. You want out of that room. Got chance? Nope. Okay. Good, good, good. There's a fire in there. It's excellent. Alright, bro, repair that. I'm take I'm taking damage, but I think it's worth it. Okay, good, 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 good. That's that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. We're fine. We're fine now. We're fine now. They're never getting that back online. Well they might get that back online, unlikely. Oh jeez, no! Oh, come on! Oh, I, I I don't need to actually do that. Okay. Okay. Zoltan's probably not gonna survive. I would be surprised if he does. Then again... Right, there we go. So, 50 scrap. I did take a lot of damage. But it might have been worth it. Was this worth it? Probably not. I will aid the Federation ship. Hello! You can't damage me! This was worth it. Let's wait for the bomb. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. Because you can't... Oh! I, I, I should probably get you back to your room. So we are taking some damage and you getting upgraded on that is good. Although beam weapons doesn't help us. But yeah, we'll see. Alright, 50 scrap. Uh, that should be enough. I think after this I should go to the store because I don't want to if I come across like a drone. Although, uh, as you can see, we can only get one more system. Like, just one more. So getting a defense drone is probably ideal and then 
some other like mind control or something to follow it up. Probably mind control is the best. Probably. Or you know you could get cloaking because hacking with a drone ship not an ideal. Uh, does work. Alright, 50 seconds. Alright, doesn't look like Yep, he got stunned. He got stunned. Alright, let's see if that double fire manages to take it down ever. Because if it does, I can arc it. Come on, come on, can you do it? Oh no, it can't. Alright. I could just let it's gonna take such a long time for that though. I'll wait for the next shot. Because it is damaging to crew. It does do crew damage, but it's so less. I mean you could win if you if I wasn't LPing on record I wouldn't mind, but just uh, the chaos cluster bomb takes so much to actually kill. It 15 damage, it needs to land seven times. Since it's random and can miss, it's not really that helpful. But when you get it up, wow. When you get it up to 20 seconds, man. Three bombs every 20, three fire bombs every 20 seconds. Imagine that. Well, he's dead. Probably? Wow, he didn't die. I find that insanity, man. Well. Okay, um, he's almost dead actually, um, is that room vented? I can't tell without senses. I guess I'll wait for the next, <laughs> I'm eventually waiting for the bomb here entirely, aren't I? Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, this shot and we'll see, we'll see how damaged the crew is. Hopefully it, 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 it'll land in places I want it to land. Because I'm not doing any hull damage. Alright, he has 88 health. He's dying. Yeah, he's gonna die. Ah, and that started a fire. Alright. It's brilliant. He's got 2 health now. Jeez, man. You guys are so boned. So boned. Wow, did you manage to repair that in time, my good sir? I am impressed. Wow. Wow, but he has two health. One health. <laughs> he might actually die. Alright. Why not? Let's just keep fighting it. Like I said, mouse is acting up. Ignore. Right. Chaos Cluster, where do you land? Oh yeah, I think one of them just died. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Uh, if you fail to repair O2, please leave. I'm repairing O2. Uh, I don't know. O2 is repaired. All right, but they are. They have taken quite a bit of damage. If only I could take down the shields. If only. Yes, I know it's 23 minutes and we're just waiting on this same one. I really don't want to be leveling these guys up, but it's just that one drone part, man. Eight scrap, man. Eight scrap. Eight scrap saved is eight scrap. Uh, okay. So um, there's a fire in there. Interesting. Well, I think fire's gonna take him. Good thing is they have only uh, five systems. They can't repair that. So that's that done. Hopefully fire will enter the shield system. Oh, looks like fire has entered the shield system. Yep. All right. The moment shield goes out, we're pretty much. Ah, there we go. Come on. Uh, oh, oh, probably have to stop that. way longer than anyone would have preferred quickly try to rescue crew oh yes um 
Sure, Mikhail, you can go on shields. Mick, 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 Mickey, go on. Why do Mickey go on shields? Or Mort go on shields? Mort is already leveled up a bit, and I do want him for counter boarding measures. Yep, okay. Bro, yours get indoors because you have no other place to be, really. That was a long fight. Uh huh. Yeah. I think I'm not gonna risk it. Just go to the store straight up and we can stop at the store. Pretty starscapes. Man, that's pretty. Alright. There's an LRS. LRS makes runs. Alright. Ugh, oh, mouse is acting up. I might accidentally buy stuff so I don't want. Alright. There's LRS. We want LRS. And uh, nothing else here. I wanted weapon. But uh, I guess we're not getting that. Alright. Cool. Let's just upgrade ship then. Okay. Okay. Yeah. It's acting up. Anyway, uh, thanks for tuning in on this first video of the Nebula Drifter. Thanks. Uh, pretty interesting, pretty good combo uh, with the combat drone. Although I do need a weapon because combat drone will soon become ineffectual against two shielded ships. But uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. Uh, do check it out when it comes out. I will link it in the description as always. And uh, go till Bayou. I said hi. Hey, hi Bayou. Hi. <laughs> yeah, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you on the next video. Till then, take care and remember, keep on flying.